Today, I'm gonna show y'all how to import in a custom RM design dash layout for your Holly F5, of course. So, first thing first, that's a must. You must have a flash drive. Uh, you can get one from any kind of store, Dollar General, Walmart, Kroger, uh, anywhere. So, after you get that, plug your flash drive in into your laptop or your computer. All right, and usually when I send you a file, it's gonna be via email. I'm using Google Chrome here and Gmail. So go to whatever email you are using. Locate the file. All right, you will notice there's going to be two attachments in here, a PNG file and an init file, which is the init file is what you're going to be importing to your Holly Dash. You want to click download all. After you download all, you're going to notice it's going to zip up this file, click on the file. And what I like to do is hold and click and drag. Grab both files, hold Control C, and copy both of those files. Minimize, go to your file explorer, find your flash drive. Then you would just want to press Control V, and you will notice I already have the files inside of my flash drive. So I'm just going to put press replace. Then after that, we're going to go over to the car. So safely remove. And over to the car. Okay, now I'm in the car. Uh, what you want to do? Power your dash on. And after you plug the up, to load in one of my layouts, if I did one for you, you want to go to menu, customize. I'm going to start clean because I just saved this one. Let's clear this. It'd be a black layout. Let's let it focus. Okay. So then you click layout, import on USB, find the name of the dash. I got a bunch of designs on here. I just did one for a guy named Vince. So then you're going to click import and voila. Uh, if you need to make any changes to things, like for instance, uh, he got this dirt road, step up, oh mine, all in. For my layout, uh, I don't have those because it's not programming my car like that. So when he loads in his stuff, let's say his uh, all in is on switch eight. All he gotta do is click switch eight and it should pop up in the label, whatever he got it programmed as. But yeah, uh, that's how you do it. Then you save it and there you go. And just to show you, I got a bunch of dashes on here. But it's, uh, when people want designs, I have to work on my car to export them out because I don't have a spare seven inch dash. But just a selection. I got a lot of stuff on here.